All right, guys, so this is the first holster I've ever made. This is just a practice piece. The leather that you see here is not the one I used. Um, I actually went to Hobby Lobby and bought a piece of leather there just to practice with because it's not the best quality of leather. And if I'm learning how to make these, I don't want to use quality leather. I just want to try to get the general idea. So, And I, I made this for World of Fast, World Fast Draw Association. Uh, I got back in the, in the wintertime. And where I started with this project is I went to Springfield Leather Company on YouTube and learned how to make a pattern, which is really where you want to start for any firearm you're making a holster for. Um, and being that this is just practice, you know, came out pretty good. Uh, the pattern works. Make sure you're putting your pattern down uh, for the side you're wanting it on, left or right, because if you put it one way, it may come out the other. So be careful with that. This is a design that I made. I call it Pushing Daisies because I'm either winning the competition or I'm not. The uh, idea for the dye design or the stain design is I wanted the inside a little bit darker even though the finish was not looking good so I changed it here you'll see. But how I did that is I wet the edges versus the middle a little bit more. Uh, here's the tooling that I did as you can see the design in the previous slide but it took me a little over an hour and a half to do from the time I did the design to tooling or cutting it into leather to, be, uh, to doing some tooling and backgrounding. You can see my stitch line there I actually took a beveler and cut it into the leather, which made a really nice finish because I actually used leather uh, cord for stitching it up. This is now the design on the leather, really starting to come alive now, um, and more what I was going for. And with the design, you know, I had an I, I did an eyeball. I really didn't trace out where my my border lines were on the holster, but it came up pretty good. You'll see here in a second what it looks like in real life. And I'm welcome to your comments and laughs. So the holster is actually a little bit too tight uh, for a fast draw rig, but it's, you know, I wanted to learn how to make fast draw rig holsters, but, you know, this is a holster I made for my practice gun uh, for World Fast Draw, and it's not really a fast draw holster, it's too tight, but just to give you an idea, your typical Hollywood, you know, draw, um, I mean, it works for that, but the World Fast Draw Association, how I was learning is your fingers on the trigger, fans hand it out here, and you come up like that, but you actually do competition, it's actually resting on the trigger well or on the leather, so something like that but it works for practice it was fun if you want one made let me know